Today marks exactly one year since Nicole Montalvo was first reported missing and today her accused killers have been here in court trying to get much of the evidence against them tossed out. Christopher Otero Rivera and his father Angel both facing murder charges for the death of St. Cloud mother Nicole Montalvo, who vanished after dropping off her son at the Rivera's home. Investigators say her body was found dismembered and buried on two properties owned by the family and only discovered after the sheriff's office excavated large areas of the properties. But the Rivera's attorneys say when the case goes to trial, jurors should not see much of the evidence against them. In court motions filed by the defense, they argue statements from the family, cell phone records and other evidence from the properties should be suppressed because when the sheriff's office got the first search warrant, it was just a missing persons case, not a crime. In court today, Otero Rivera's lawyer questioned the lead detective about what evidence they had in the beginning to prompt the search. Did you locate Nicole Montalvo or any evidence linking to Nicole Montalvo in the main house? No. In the wooden structure? No. In the trailers? No. In any of the vehicles? No. Prosecutors have said that Otero Rivera's history of violence toward Montalvo and lies from Angel Rivera pointed to criminal activity and prompted the search of the home. Right now, the Riveras are set to go on trial in December. In Osceola County, Bob Hazen. <laughs>